This story is about a true story of a black American who works as a cleaner, but he wants to become a doctor. Today, I'm going to explain a story which is based on a true incident, called, Something the Lord Made. This incident started in Nashville. It's the year 1930, a time when there's discrimination between blacks and whites, where black people are not given equal rights. Here, we see a man named Vivian, who is very distressed, because, today he's been fired from his job without any fault of his own. He goes to his friend, who takes him to a doctor. The doctor gives him a job and here, his job is to clean in their lab. Vivian always had a passion for studying. He wanted to become a doctor. But his dream never came true. So, after his work, whenever he gets time, he reads medical books. The doctor sees Vivian studying but doesn't discourage him because he doesn't have racial bias in his heart or mind. One day, the doctor comes to him and gives him a white doctor's blazer. Vivian becomes very happy upon receiving it. As time passes, Vivian gains a lot of medical knowledge. One day, the doctor says, why don't you become my assistant? After this, the doctor teaches him many things, and now Vivian has become his assistant. But Vivian's dream is to obtain a real medical degree and become a real doctor. For this, he also saves money. Vivian is now married, he is happy in his life, but one day the stock market crashes in America. As a result, all the big companies and banks go bankrupt completely. For the past seven years, he had been saving money for medical studies. The bank has also gone bankrupt. It's mean, he won't get a single penny. As time passes, the year 1943 comes, and America has now joined World War II. Consequently, most doctors in America are deployed to war sites to treat soldiers. And the doctor, whom Vivian works for are offered a job in a big hospital, which he accept. The doctor meets a very wealthy couple whose baby is suffering from a very dangerous disease, called, Blue Baby Syndrome. This disease is congenital, where the heart does not function properly, and if the patient is to be kept alive for a long time, a heart transplant is required. No human has undergone a heart transplant yet because to do so, the heart must be removed, and if it's not fitted back within three minutes, the patient will die. Here, we see Vivian working as a waiter. Actually, Vivian still works with the doctor and does part-time jobs to earn money. The doctor now wants to treat this disease, meaning he wants to perform a heart transplant. Vivian also works with him. One day, the doctor is called to a very big hospital, named Johns Hopkins Hospital. Vivian goes with him, but he is not allowed entry from the front gate, because he is black man. He is told to enter from the back gate. Although the doctor tries to explain that Vivian works with him, but no one believes him. Vivian is forced to enter through the back gate, and now both the doctor and Vivian start working at this hospital. Whenever the staff see Vivian in a white blazer, they are surprised, because it's a doctor's blazer, and until now, no black person has worn a white blazer here. Black people only do small jobs here. Vivian's life isn't easy, he has very little money. Therefore, even now, he works part-time jobs at night. In the hospital, the doctor meets another female doctor who is a heart researcher, and she is also working on the same disease, Baby Blue. They meet a parent whose child has a disease, but the doctor says that at first we have to create this disease inside a dog, which is the most difficult task. Because, this disease is congenital, it cannot be created separately. Vivian assists the doctor. Actually, at this time, there is a severe shortage of doctors. Doctors and Vivian work day and night. Vivian now has a lot of knowledge, and he works with the doctor. His wife tells him that now you have to do something so that the whole world will praise you. You have been in this field for many years, and you have a lot of knowledge about the medical field. Many doctors try to create this disease inside dogs, but they are not successful. Vivian works day and night, and he also creates many tools that can help in the operation. He thinks in different ways about how to transplant the heart and how to create this disease inside the dog. One day, when Vivian goes to the canteen, he carefully observes that only black people are around. It's mean, no white person is there. When he inquires about it, he finds out that this section is only for C-grade employees, whereas he is an A-grade employee. He goes to the receptionist where he finds out that the salary he is receiving is equivalent to that of a C-grade employee. This makes him very angry. Such incidents happen with him only because he is a black man. Vivian goes to the doctor and says that he is leaving this job forever. He takes off his blazer. The doctor tries to stop him, but he doesn't stop. But after he leaves, the doctor find out that the disease that Vivian was working on in the dog has been successful, which is no less than a miracle. But now, they face a bigger challenge. They have to transplant the heart of the dog. And when they will succeed in this task, they will transplant the hearts of all those children who have this disease. 
but now, the doctor needs Vivian for this task. They have been together for the past 12 years, and the doctor knows that he is very capable and hardworking. Therefore, the doctor goes to the head of the hospital and says that Vivian's salary should be increased to what he deserves. He should be paid as much as he deserves, and he should be moved from Class C to Class A. The head of the hospital agrees, after which Vivian also returns to work, and now they have to transplant the heart which is not so easy. Vivian also finds a solution for this where they can get an extra half hour for performing heart transplants which is called bypass surgery. Now the doctor and Vivian together perform a heart transplant on a dog. This is the first time a heart is being replaced, and they succeed in this task. After that, they transplant the heart of another dog, and they are successful in that too. This means, now they can transplant the hearts of blue babies, and this will be the first time in human history. After this, the doctor meets the parents of that child who has a blue baby. The doctor explains to them, we have been successful in transplanting the heart, and now we want to transplant your child's heart. But this is very dangerous, and the child's life could also be at risk. But those people agreed, because by doing this, their child will be completely fine. The next day, the doctor and Vivian find out that the stitches inside the dog, whose heart they transplanted, have opened, which causes its death. Vivian and the doctor are very sad about this. Now they see that the stitches they applied had not spread with the muscles due to which it's broke and the dog died. Now they have to apply stitches inside in such a way that it's spread with the muscles and break less, for which they use special cloth. Vivian also makes many tools for this operation, which help a lot in the surgery. And now they quickly make such threads so that they can apply stitches inside. The day comes when they will transplant the child's heart. There are many doctors inside the operation theater, but Vivian is not there because he doesn't have any medical degree. But when the doctor finds out about this, he gets very angry and calls Vivian inside and says that he will not perform the operation, he will just stand behind me. And now the child's heart transplant begins. But soon, the child's oxygen starts dropping, which scares all the doctors because, if oxygen is not stopped from dropping, the child will die. But the doctors don't stop their surgery, because they don't have any other option now. They transplant the heart, and after that, the child's oxygen starts coming back. The child's face, which had turned completely blue, now starts turning normal again. It's mean the operation was successful. And this was the world's first heart transplant when doctors transplanted a human heart. All the doctors become very happy. The whole world comes to know that the treatment for blue baby syndrome has been found. After this, all parents bring their children who have blue syndrome to the hospital. The doctors start by transplanting their hearts. Here, doctors and their team are given many big awards everywhere. Their photos are everywhere, but there is never a place where Vivian's photo is found. While he played the biggest role in finding this treatment, the doctor and his team are honored separately in different places. One day, Vivian goes to the place where the doctors are being honored. When the doctor announced everyone's name, he doesn't mention Vivian's name, which completely breaks Vivian, because he trusted the doctor so much. He understands that he has been used. The next day, he goes to the hospital and he resigns from his job, telling the doctor that he won't come back. After those days, Vivian goes to Morgan College and says that I want to take the final exam for a medical degree. I have studied everything. But he is told that it's not possible he has to start everything from the first semester. But Vivian has already studied everything, he just needs a degree so that he can become a legal doctor. Vivian returns home and takes up small jobs to run his household, but his heart isn't in it. His wife tells him that he should meet the doctor. After his wife convinces him, he goes to the doctor. The doctor puts him back to work, and after that, Vivian performs many heart transplants. Time keeps passing, and now people's perspectives have changed. The discrimination that existed between black and white people has now completely ended legally. Vivian was made as the director of the lab. One day, he goes to the Hall of Fame with the doctor, where the photos of those who are great achievers are displayed. Today, the doctor's photo is there, although Vivian's photo should also be there because he stood by the doctor at every step. He had the biggest role in the heart transplant surgery, but here only the photo of Dr. Alfred Blaylock is displayed, although Vivian was always with him. Vivian's photo is not here because he neither had a medical degree nor was he ever recognized for this work. And along with that, another fault of his is that he is a black American. Actually, legal discrimination between black and white people has ended, but the bias that exists in people's hearts is still there. Gradually as time passes, and one day the doctor passes away, but Vivian still works at the hospital. He performs heart transplants and now he is also a trainer. He teaches other doctors how heart transplants are done. 
and after 40 years, Vivian is invited to give a speech for the first time, where he talks about his work, his early life, and how he and the doctor worked together on heart transplants. Remembering those moments of his life, brings tears to his eyes. Now he is very old, and after a few days, Vivian's photo is also displayed in the same hall of fame, where the doctor's photo is. Here, the photos of those people in the medical field are displayed, who have completely changed the medical world with their work. With the help of Dr. Alfred Blablock and his own dedication, Vivian accomplished what seemed impossible. In the Hall of Fame, where he once worked as a cleaner, his photo is now displayed. At the end of this story, we see the real photo of Dr. Alfred Blablock and Vivian, whose full name is Vivian Thomas's. If a person has passion for their work and dedication, no matter how much the world holds them back, they always move forward. Just like the sunlight dispels darkness, a person's hard work and dedication transform every failure into success. We hope you enjoyed this true story.